Okie dokes, we're back. So, first video was about building the gearbox, steps one, two, and three. Um, next kind of thing we're moving on to is attaching the damper mounts to the, to the chassis. So, here's one I made earlier. So there's the chassis and these little clips have gone on the back. Um, then you have to make these things called rear axle stays, which have been done. And there's some really flimsy little springs in here, which I hear break quite easily. But we'll see how we go, I guess. Um, and then, oops. I think this is where it will start coming together. Step six is where we add the gearbox and the axle stays to the main chassis itself. Um, so there we go. Here's the gearbox. You use this big chunky metal rod to connect it all through. And then what we got going on in number seven? We got some shock absorbers being made in step seven, eight, and nine, and then attached in ten. So we'll see how we get on. And as always, we'll do some update videos on the way. Okay, so gearbox is, uh, you can see there, officially mounted um, to the car. Nothing really keeping it in place from flopping around, but that's been done. That was step six. Got these side bumpers on as well. And then step seven is the um, start of the suspension. So made kind of the piston shafts you can see there they're going to go inside got the lids need to get the um, oil the damper oil so that is the next step to be building them putting them together and then the damper oil goes in in eight let me screw it all together nine attach it in ten another update to follow okay and you can see both dampers are kind of set and ready for the oil to go in so there we go okay so here's the first one done um, nice little return on that I'm pleased with that with the oil and then um, just a bit more detail I suppose oil goes in here you put this little plunger at the top you can see you insert the plunger at the top and you screw it in to tighten it and then you've got this big screw goes over the top it's a tiny little screw that goes inside and then the uh, the cap goes on and if you want there's a little spacer you can use um, for soft damper tension do not use this part so anyway I'm not using that part on my one and then we'll mount them onto the chassis So there we have it, step 10 complete. The uh, suspension has been mounted on to the gearbox and the main chassis. So now you've got this nice bit of return coming on. And then as well as it flexing there, you can just see it, it flexes in here as well. So it's a very live rear end. Uh, interesting to see how it's gonna work actually. But that's that. Next video, we'll be looking at the electronics, servos, mounting things into the chassis. There we go.